Today we're gonna find out what's better, cat food, chicken, or just good old fish. Got three traps, we're gonna set them up in the river. First one, we'll go chicken. The next one, we'll put fish, I'm gonna cut it in half. All right, we'll throw a head in there. This one, we'll put cat food. Instead of cracking the top, I'm just gonna stab a couple of holes in that sucker. I'm gonna use the cat food. I stabbed holes in it. We're just gonna slide that in there. All right, got the three traps, and I'm gonna go set them up in three different spots. First one with chicken, I'm gonna toss right here. And we'll come back in like 15 minutes. Probably don't even have to tie it off, honestly. The next one, got the fish head. I'm gonna chuck it right back here. Oh, I just seen one swim away. We'll tie it off to a branch up here. And the last one with the cat food, I'm just gonna chuck right here. It's a little shallow, but I just seen a couple swim away, so, oh, should be good. Tie it off right here. While waiting for those traps to fill up, we went and got some by hand. Here's some clips of that. Got him. Walking up onto the fish head one, I see a couple outside and a couple inside. There's, oh, there's one right there. I pulled the chunk off. I just seen him swim away. There's a couple here. There's only three in there. There's some decent sized ones, but there's a bunch around, so I'm gonna drop it back and uh, wait. All right, this is the chicken. Wow. Well, there's none in there. This chicken one, literally nothing in there. All right, and this is the last one with the canned cat food and there's literally nothing in that either. So, turns out what we've been using is the best anyways, fish heads. Check this out, this is the biggest salamander I'd ever seen in my entire life. And yeah, don't worry, we put it back. All right, back to check again. And, yep, in the chicken chap, Absolutely nothing, just a couple of sucker fish. Over here, the canned cat food, there's absolutely nothing, not even fish in there. So that's pretty shit too, or pretty, pretty bad too. And then over to the half of the fish, dead fish, we got uh, three now, but it's the only one that seems to work. So I, uh, left this to go put a trap up there by the bridge with some more fish in it and the uh oh no this is the fish head oh, okay yeah the fish head's doing work you see a bunch in there i left it shallow and they're, cla they're crawling up there there's even a bunch over there coming to it so i'm gonna leave that alone give it a little while and the cat food is just it's surprisingly not working but uh, i don't know I'm going to take it out and replace it with fish. We'll see. At this point, the mosquitoes had been bothering me for a while, so I went up with what I had caught, and I cooked it. We got all our crawfish in here with an aerator to keep them good and lively. And then over here, we got some corn. I put some sausage in there, too, and a bunch of spices. Just waiting for it to boil. All right. Strain them out. Still nice and lively. Eat some. Oh, rock. Right there. I'm gonna bring it back up to the boil. Got that lemon pepper. I'm just gonna put a good little hefty amount in there, you know? Like, that's pretty good. Let it warm up there. It was taking too long to melt in the enamel cup, so I just switched it over to a little pan. And clean it out. 
Look at the size of that one. It's even got claw meat on it. Look at that. With some butter. Mmm. After eating, I took a walk over to the bridge. By chance, I managed to get there right as they were building the dam. Take a look. Here's before they add a couple. What are they gonna, they're gonna add like three more? Yeah, I probably wouldn't even have brought any other to build it. Go up. After they put all the logs into place, they added a black plastic liner so they could seal most of the leaks. This is where I conclude the video. All in all, it was an amazing day, but I was exhausted. So I sat and enjoyed the fire at dark, and by midnight, I was in bed, calling it a night.